yeah, I came back to the icicle place. That was the plan. Okay. Uh, back to some bean and nothingness stuff. Um, icy bean and nothingness stuff. So what did I do last time? I can't remember. I, I think I did some stuff in... Was it Bucketland? I think it was Bucketland. Um, so, okay, what do we have here? This is a good idea to come here. There's probably some, there's some mom beans around. We can do some mom beans. <laughs> Although eventually I'm going to end up with just loads of like four and five bean puzzles to do. And then I'm quite scared because I, I mean, part of it is that, you know, I like my videos to be around half an hour long. And, uh, if every puzzle is taking me like an hour at a time, I don't usually want to give up after just half an hour, like, I would rather keep focusing on it. Um, but, and, and, and I guess the other thing is that if I have to spend more time per video, that's just more of my spare time each week playing games, which I don't have a lot of. So, um, like the half an hour, per, half an hour a day, because there's one video a day, that works out really well for me. Um, so yeah, the idea that there might be a point where I'm doing like puzzles that take an hour or more for each one, that scares me. Maybe I'll just start splitting them up, like do half an hour and do half an hour next day, but I guess we'll see. Um, so icicles, so they shoot out like an X, I think two spaces diagonally or maybe three spaces diagonally. Uh, and they freeze stuff and the frozen stuff can go into water and the frozen stuff can also be smashed against the wall to make beans again. That's everything I remember. So what do we have here? We have this, which is going to bring that up and that down. Yes. And this is the uh, slime. Not mud. It's slime. It looks like ice in this case. Um, okay. So I can't cross that. I have to go this way. And I have to get past this. After, so I, I have to be past here. Do something from here that makes that um, switch get pressed. And I have a cloud and an icicle. The problem being that I can't just make like a like the easy thing to do would be to put an icicle there, which will hold that down, right? That's not an icicle. The other one. Oh, and also I can't leave. I just freeze. Um, but put that there, and then put a cloud down. And make that a cloud and that would make the th I could do that from the other side of the slime I'd be able to get across but I can't do that however I could put a cloud down here but then I can't put a cloud here oh I bet the frozen cloud counts as weight that's what this is going to be okay oh my gosh making the entire crux of a puzzle uh Oh, do I need to... I'm going to be dropping everything down here, it's fine. Uh, so, icicle here. Cloud here. You're making the entire crux of a puzzle based on an interaction I've never done before. That's, that's scary. Especially when the puzzle isn't... I mean, I've done it quite quickly, I guess. Assuming this is right. Yes. <laughs> um, still, I mean, it's a scary thing to do. Somebody could get stuck for a long time not realising that a, a frozen cloud would, would weigh more. <laughs> I guess because it puts that box around it, it makes sense, like the ice cube. Um, but you could imagine it just freezes the cloud suspended in air, maybe? I don't know. Like, depending on how you intuit that, how that would work, that interaction, you could either think, well, that could never possibly help me, or that will definitely help me. That's a risky thing to base a puzzle on that isn't, like, forced. I, if I were designing a game, I would, like, first have a puzzle that forces that, like, trivially I think maybe but it worked it worked I don't know maybe I'm, in this case it's probably fine seven green beans Ooh, we've got vines and icicles oh no wait how many spaces is this one two three four five six seven that can't be coincidence that cannot be coincidence and I have to cross the water huh is there something weird like I guess let's see how a frozen vine behaves. Or, yeah, I mean, I mean, it's, I guess it's frozen. What about when its arm is frozen? 
Ah. Oh yeah, I could test that like this. And then I get frozen here and I can't move and we're stuck. Okay, nothing interesting there. Oh, oh, hold on. What if I'm not using the vines as vines? What if I'm just... Freezing them. Oh. I, mean, I can't get past you now. Uh, uh, you come back. I'm uh, pushing them in the water. And then just walking along them. That would make sense, but then why do I put you to make that work? Because I'd also have to get them all in line with where they need to go. Hmm. Yeah, how's this going to work? Oh, well, you stretch three in each direction, so... If you go right in the middle... No, you stretch two in each direction. So no, that does not solve it. Also, I'm trapped. Wait, I, need to, I can't push you into the ice beam thing. I have to. You have to already be frozen. I can't move the icicle after I've placed it. So somehow I need to freeze you and then push you into position. Unless I push them all along each other. Instead of from the side, but then I, there's no room down here to do that. Except the first one could be... No. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, just making noises. <laughs> If the first one was frozen and I pushed it in, and then the next ones I just like somehow froze on there, but I, um, It's a very specific position that you can go. We need to not block this path. It has to be somewhere along here. I can't get past. Do I use the vines in some way as vines? And if I do, how? They could grab a bean. Also, there's all this space. No, that, no I did want to do what I just did. Uh, no, that's... You could, like, grab a thing. That's, oh, you could grab that. Ah, okay. Understood. Ish. Partly. Okay, so what I'm thinking is if you... If I make you a thing... Let's say I did this. Okay. Uh, wait, no, I'm doing everything the wrong way around. Ha. Ah. Green up there. This isn't going to be it, but oh, probably the last one freezes as well. Okay, I'm going to do this. I don't think I need to do this, but I'm going to do this. Uh, I'm going to get grabbed. Oh no, that's going to get grabbed. <laughs> what am I thinking? What I'm thinking is. Make you alive. Make you alive. Make you alive. You grab that. And then each of these freezes. Ah. Duh, 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 duh. They would have to be already there. 
So what happens if I put you there? What happens if the icicle gets to the to the vine? Do we have another situation where there's an interaction? I don't know yet. Do you freeze? You do. Okay. But that would only be one of them. Like it could be the one at the end. Mm. No, you wouldn't be able to pull it through the others. But yeah, it could be the one at the end. So I think my setup before was right. Okay. So Ivy up here. Somehow these, oh gosh, not all of them. Somehow these exist without, oh, no, that's okay, I can do it. I can walk along this path. Uh, oh no, then that happens. I don't mean to grab each other. Oh, I'll do them one at a time, but I can't. Like I, could, like I could make you come alive and then, oh, what if I, set you off and then make them come alive one by one as it moves. Oh, no, you have to be... Ha. You, oh gosh. You have to exist, but then I'm at the wrong end of this. That uses a, that uses time, and then step out of the way. That would work, I think. If you go one here, so uh, 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 uh. Oh no, I'm on the wrong side of this thing. Ah. <laughs> Your arms in the way. Then that happens. So I need to be one further. Go here. Ah. Uh. How am I going to get all these? Because moving takes a turn, and so does. Magicking. Then I get frozen. And then eventually you get there and you freeze, which is great, but. Okie dokie. But every single one of these takes two turns for me, whereas you only take one turn to move. And they can't all be alive. Well, they no, they can't. Well, I can't make you alive, and then make the next one alive. Oh, I can. Okay. Well, there we go. You can go like that. And uh, and then just make you alive and step out of the way over here. And am I safe? I'm safe. I'm gonna get these can all go in. Yay. Okay, cool. Oof. These puzzles. There's so many different interactions between all the things. <laughs> How many beans was that? It doesn't tell me. That was a two. Okay. Oh, have I read this? Probably not. From the desk of Carl Eichinger, PhD, the Tradition Project. Field notes, it's been very hard to concentrate on my field work here while my other projects are going so well. I think we'll have the first artificial puzzle up and running soon. I'm sure Frank and Michelle can handle everything else. Artificial puzzle? As opposed to the natural ones? Uh, this is a one bean, this far and no further. And it does say that in the corner, as I noticed last time. Okay, so. There is a bomb, but it's there. It's by its, it's, it's over there, it's alone. 
This far, no further. Okay, that's telling me that I want the ivy to grab that. The ivy, the vine, to grab that. And then stop there, which I can probably make happen by freezing it. Or by freezing the... Something. Let's freeze you. Oh, yeah, this is exactly what we want. Then I go past and die, so you have to be in a different position. Do I have time? No. Uh, 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 uh. I can get past, get this, and we're done. That truly was a one bean. Oh, the level title is very helpful. <laughs> Hooray, a bridge. Okie dokie, what's this? It's huge, but it's just a two bean. Cold courier, okay. Uh, we have lots of monsters we can make. Buckets. Well, not just lots, but like interesting combinations. Bucket is one blue. So I've got two buckets. Cloud is two white, so I've got two clouds. Icicle is blue and a white, so I've got two icicles. Icicles are made out of half of a cloud and a bucket. Classic icicle recipe. And we've got a roller that just exists. Uh, and so the issue here is that you're gonna always kill me, so you need to be frozen somehow. We also have gates here that I can never walk to. Something else is going to go on these. Probably the bucket, since none of the, the other two can't move. So bucket's gonna walk across here somehow. I mean, it can just let itself through. I guess this prevents it from going back. Why the two? I don't know yet. And somehow an icicle needs to be created here. Okay, so let's just let's just think about this. Let's put a let's pick these up. Let's send a look at that way. You go there. You could drop everything. Well, but you only take one thing at a time. That's going to be an issue. But I've got two buckets. Ah, but I want you to take a blue because I want to make an icicle there, like this, right? And then have you drop it? But I need a white there as well. How's that going to work? Because then the other thing I can do, well no, the other thing I can do is like send another bucket up here to put a white up there, to, two whites up there to make a cloud? How's that going to ha happen? That's never going to happen. Huh. I can't explode anything. I can't explode buckets anyway. I can explode. Well, I can't explode anything because I don't have a bomb. So, yep. Okay. What? The only thing that can walk through those gates is a bucket. I can only make one bucket because I need the other blue for the icicle. Yep. I can't redirect a bucket after it's moving. Like I can make a bucket up here. Something's going to go this way, presumably. This is not where I want the icicle to be. Sure, I could make you take two things here if I wanted to. Oh. Ah. Sure. I could freeze the bucket. Does that help? Oh, and reposition. Oh, I can smash things apart. I can blow things up. However, that means you're there now. And I can't freeze you like that. Okay, that's going to be the key. I can break things. I could break a bucket. I can make two buckets. And break it apart, potentially. Ooh, 
Oof, complicated. I'm almost certain that I do want an icicle here, right, to freeze you. Almost certain. In fact, certain. If I froze a bucket somewhere, what would I need? A blue and a white. But there's a blue in there, I've already set on white that way. But I can make a cloud there. Okay, hold on, let's pick stuff up. Bucket here. Send the cloud that way. Okay. Okay, now we have a cloud there, and I can freeze you if I want to. Oh, gosh. Oh, but then you're stuck against there, because I've got them the other row, which is probably what I wanted. But let's think about what this would mean. I've frozen you. My icicle's up here. I can't break the icicle. Problematic, because I need the icicle somewhere else, right? Right? That's why that water's there, next to the roller. I can make another icicle if I break open the, the bucket, which I can do. Will this smash? No. But this will? If you hit the cloud? Yes. Uh oh, but then you come back alive again. I think I want to push the bucket a bucket with a white in it, frozen, down here. Is that doable? Okay. <laughs> a bucket with a white in it, because then when it smashes, it will be a blue and a white together. I think that's the trick. Okay, what do I want? I want to send two of these that way, on this row. Okay, then we have a cloud. I want to freeze you. I don't need to make the cloud yet. Freeze you, push you this way. I can grab what you're made of. Hmm, okay, but I want to freeze you there, but also be able to freeze you down here. Okay, hold on. So, here. Uh, uh, oh, not there, there, push you up, you'll smash, where do I get my other, oh, I've got another white, yes, yes, uh, I don't want you to, I guess I could just move you down this way, like this, you pick that up, you freeze, I push you this way, you slide through, Yep, you smash, I make the cloud, you wake that up, ta-da, that's a fantastic puzzle, <laughs> really good, oh moly, okay, that was cool, um, neat, one, one bean, okay, two rollers and an icicle, and the exits on the other side some water, so I have to fill in the water. I have to fill in both waters. Yep. So the rollers are for freezing. Is that the entire thing? F freeze two rollers. Well, the issue is going to be how do I get them in? Well, can I position the icicle in such a way that it's like here? And then the rollers are... This isn't going to work because if I make a roller here... It's going to freeze there and I can't push it. Except with the other roller. But then can I get you where I want you? No. However, if you had been in a different position, no, but I need to be able to freeze on that row. I need to freeze on the two rows that I'm pushing the things into, I think. 
the two rows with water. Because if I freeze on any other row, then I have to somehow get the ice cube to another row without it smashing. Which isn't going to happen. I like this setup. Problem is... Oh, I can bring you back this way. Yeah, I can do this. Yay! And I can push you this way. Hooray! Another cool puzzle. What have we got? Two bean? There's like nothing here. This can't be complicated. <laughs> right? I feel across all this water. This is a fun setup. Uncrossable pond. Across all this water. Using just a roller and an icicle. Huh? I have to ride a block. But it's not like the roller keeps right keeps going, right? <laughs> right? I mean Let's find out. Definitely not. But I've got across the water. I can't go across the jelly or the slime. Is there some way I... Oh, clever. This is a cool twist. <laughs> Very cool twist. I love it. No. Mm, hold on. Um, let's just reset. Oh, it has to be here. Hold on. So... I freeze, you don't freeze. At least until I'm... Hmm, no, okay. Hold on. Over here then instead. Ah, look at it! Look at me go! And I don't break up into my constituent beans because I guess I'm not made of beans. <laughs> oh, and I got another area. Okay, those are a bunch of really cool puzzles. This area is more exciting than I expected. Very nice. Okay, um... <clears throat> We can cross the bridge. Let's go read some stuff, uh, but I think we'll continue with the puzzles next time. Uh, let's go see what this says. Field notes. Well, it looks like the field work is on us for the rest of this island. I see why Michelle is annoyed, but I'm having a great time. We only have so long to spend in the temple. It's great to have the chance to get more research experience while we're here. Why is Michelle annoyed? Whatever. <laughs> uh, okay, what do we have? Oh, the end of the island. Wait, is this a really small island? No, it's just that the, the end of it is halfway along the path for a change. Uh, what does this mean for difficulties? Threes and twos? And a four. And I haven't got to the next bit yet, so we'll find that out later. Okay, cool. I'm enjoying this place, so I might continue here next time. Even though it's going to get way more difficult, it seems. That's such a fun twist, freezing yourself and smashing the cube on the other side. I really like that. Neat. Anyway, goodbye.